Demo Africa is a platform for tech innovators across Africa seeking to launch their ideas into the market. During this year's edition of the event, recently held in Lagos, 40 entrepreneurs launched their innovations. The purpose of the event is to, is to bring uh, innovators, uh, entrepreneurs, startups, um, uh, different uh, stakeholders in the industry um, uh, who are interested in, in harnessing this innovation, harnessing these startups, um, and essentially creating viable uh, business opportunities uh, for, for small businesses that, that want to leverage the benefits of uh, technology uh, to create viable businesses. Young entrepreneurs from different parts of Africa presented and showcased their solutions as a way of attracting partners and sponsors across the continent. We are leveraging essentially on information technology to make sure that people have access to this information in a way that is extremely easy. Very easy. I mean, from the comfort of your office or your home, you can easily find an apartment to rent or buy and connect with professional real estate agents and developers in a way that is safe, reliable, and um, and efficient. We're here at Demo Africa to interact, to engage with uh, fellow businesses, fellow software entrepreneurs and also to pitch our product to investors to show them what wonderful thing we're working on. Uh, the reason we started SciSci was because we saw that there was a major problem in Africa which was internet connectivity. We, a lot of people struggle to connect to the internet on a daily basis and what we have done is created a technology that allows people to connect wherever they are. So SciSci has created a router that, are, that is going to be placed in public locations like hotels, airports, and anywhere you can think of, as well as inside minibuses like Matatus and Danfors. The Director General of the National Information Technology Development Agency, NIDTA, Mr. Peter Jack, opined that the agency as a clearinghouse of IT in Nigeria would support tech startups. The main motive here is to give opportunity to our young startups to be exposed to opportunities for investment. Today we have about 40 of them here with us and the, they are going to pitch their startup ideas to a global audience. It is hoped that this young techpreneurs will showcase Africa to the rest of the world as a productive and innovative continent, a paradigm shift from worldview of Africa as a continent, a paradigm shift from the worldview of Africa as a dark continent. It's like when, when you are investing and planting good seeds. So first of all, it increases wealth. When it increases wealth, not only does it increase wealth, it increases wealth the right way. And therefore, it increases welfare. And it makes Nigeria a lot more prosperous and makes us a lot more respectable. And you and I know what happens a number of times you go abroad and they maltreat you because you are Nigerian. Nobody shows respect. Now we are bringing it clear and making it loud that listen, we are black, we are not daft, we can do it.